Hey guys, Mark Spector Comics here, and I'm back with a Hot Book Alert. This is Hot Book Alert number six, and this comes out today on New Comic Book Day. So um, I was alerted a few days back, I believe this was on uh, Jim Comics uh, YouTube channel, about last week um, issues from Superman number 14 and Supergirl number 33 were uh, recalled. So um, retailers. Well, we're told to destroy all copies of Superman number 14 and Supergirl number 33 because the year of the villain covers didn't reflect the content in the books. So uh, replacements with new covers will be shipped on August 28th. Um, I did see the covers for Superman 14 and Supergirl number uh, 33 and um, I was like, okay. Um, didn't really understand why um, the covers were recalled, but um, I looked at Superman number 14, you know, it said, You're the villain, Dark Gifts. I'll put uh, pictures of the covers on there if you haven't seen it already. So on the trade, it said Superman 14 and Supergirl 33. They both said, You're the villain and the Dark Gifts. Um, at the bottom, it said, The Last Temptation of Lois Lane. It was actually a pretty neat cover. And um, I want to say the Supergirl 33, it actually looked pretty cool. It had uh, some, I don't know, robot figure um, tying her up, had like a little bondage cover esque looking thing to it. And uh, at the bottom it says, Nothing can stop the new Brainiac. So it actually, you know, is the first appearance of the new Brainiac in that issue. So that's key as well. But um, I was uh, looking on eBay really quick. And the prices of these books were just absolutely ridiculous. Um, just for this, so there's four books total. Each one had a variant cover as well. Um, but they were, you know, going for some ridiculous prices on eBay. For one of the books alone, were like around $40. And um, for the whole set of four, people were selling for like $150 plus. Ching, if you ended up... Uh, getting any of those. Um, I'm here in New England and I don't believe any retailer in this whole area got a book. As far as I know, probably nobody in the East Coast got a book at all. If you did, you know, consider yourself lucky. But if you did, let me know as well because I, I was told that nothing got sent out here. But um, so, like I said, yeah, um, it's definitely going to be the hot book of the week. I guarantee it. It's just because of the amount of books that were destroyed. Um, so the few that actually made it out to the retailers, you know, they sold them, of course. And um, from what I was told is that Diamond's gonna send the new, those new issues on the 28th at no cost to the retailers, which is great. Um, so, so yeah, that's your uh, hot book alert for this week. It's uh, Superman number 14 and Supergirl number 33 because it was recalled issues. Um, and then I was emailed today from uh, Nick from Key Collector uh, app. If you guys don't follow him already, you know, please do. It's a great app. There's a lot of great information on there. But um, so there was some information let out from the Absolute Carnage number one. So it was told that a couple weeks back, CC Sabelski, I believe he's the editor in chief from Marvel, urged comic readers to look especially close at their copies of Absolute Carnage number one. And here's why. Got the uh, images up there for you. So Marvel put hidden sketches in random Absolute Carnage number one cover A's. So just cover A's only. So if you look at the back, the last page, 20 lucky people we'll get original sketches from Mark Bagley, uh, which is just awesome. So consider yourself uh, very lucky if you got one of those copies. Um, as far as I know, only two of them have been found. Um, unfortunate for me, I didn't get a cover A when that uh, book came out. I only got the um, one of the variant covers. This was the, uh, the cover by Cooter. I thought it was pretty neat because it had this um, new character on here, which you know didn't show up on uh, 
in the absolute carnage number one. Maybe it'll show up down the road. Maybe number three because uh, that's what Donny Cates likes to do is uh, put key issues on uh, the third uh, issue of his runs. So um, if you get a chance, drop back to your LCSs. Look for those um, cover A's in the back and see if you were fortunate to get one of those 20 original sketches done by Mark Bagley. So yeah, so uh, that's it for today. Um, Mark Specta Comics here. If you like what you see, please like, share, and subscribe. And hot book alert number six. All right, until next time, out.